23C is for cookie, good enough for me. All right guys, welcome back to the channel. It's getting down to the end right now. It is like a week and a half left in March and we are on last ice. A little bit of water to get on this morning, but the ice out here, the integrity is still great. So we have a few days left, some rain, switch back over to panfish. I got no clients left. So we're out here searching for crappies. Myself, Darian behind the camera and uh, should be a great day. It's announcing like plus 11 today, sun, clear skies. Probably gonna start in this spot, see if we can get some crappies. If not, move on and try a perch spot for the rest of the day. Maybe some sight fishing, shallow, clear water on the St. Lawrence. And then uh, we'll probably come back here for the evening bite for crappies tonight. So there's already some holes drilled from where guys have been here, obviously in the last two days. And uh, we're gonna get dropped, get in. We're gonna start with like a derby slayer uh, from Frostbite on a small tungsten jig along with uh, the small, small tantrum from Frostbite. And uh, let's see what we can do. Hopefully we can get on some slaps. Let's go. Big fish. Huge white bass. What? No. Thought I had a monster crappie. Big old white bass. Paused? Yeah. Crushed it. That is going in the shore lunch tonight. Me and Darian are having fish on the mini tantrum. All right guys, so we've done a little bit of moving around. We tried three different sets of holes. Haven't had to drill a hole yet. We're just using old holes. Darren got a rock bass. I had a small perch. We moved over here. Darren dropped in the Mega Live and was like, we gotta move there. There's blobs everywhere. Put down that little mini tantrum, white bass. Uh, I received uh, the catch and cook from Jay and Josh McFadden. So uh, we're gonna be putting that to use tonight. Some spicy, crunchy, Hopefully crappies as well, but white bass for now. And uh, yeah, let's drop back down there. There's a ton of fish. That's my first white bass in a long time and uh, should be super good eating. What do you think it is? Carp? Yeah. He's not gonna fit in this hole. Oh God. Ice fishing carp, baby. See him? Nope. <laughs> I think he's big. I think he's big too. I set the hook and I thought it was snagged. He's not that big, I don't think. You think I'm gonna land him? Yeah. We are gonna land him. Bust up the camera for this one. It's a 30 pounder. Is it? Yeah, it's gigantic. Actually? Yeah. I might be able to get his head up the hole though. Is he gonna fit? It's a blimp! That's a great crap! I didn't look at the camera. Wow. <laughs> my first carp on the ice, baby. Oh, yeah. Well, just got my first ever carp on the ice. Also, probably my carp with like the biggest shoulders. This thing is just so tall. I thought maybe it was a pike or something until it came onto frame and I saw like the big head and the fin separation. I was like, okay, that's a carp. Angie came over, got it through like an eight inch hole somehow. But yeah, so. Uh, that's amazing. Let's go ahead and get her back. Yeah. <laughs> Covered me in slime. Let's get a good release. Beautiful. Yes, oh, sick. sir. My first carp on the ice. Sick.
on the Frostbite slap shot with size 3 lemon head jigging wrap. See if we can get that focus. I just previewed to you guys the fish, but uh, yeah, this is my second ever crappie. And you know how it goes fishing with casting concrete, you just catch trophies. Like, second ever crappie, it was 13 and a half. Yeah, 13 and a half. I don't know if that's a trophy exactly, but oh, yeah, it is by far the biggest crappie I've ever caught. And just look at that fish, it was beautiful. We're here watching carp on the screen, and I just saw this fish, and I was like, I was just suspended, and this fish came in suspended looked at my bait and I was like wait a second that's not a carp I started lifting and he just crushed it he slack lined me and the hook set and everything's on Andrew's camera so what a beautiful fish such a nice fish let's go ahead and get her back what a gorgeous slab look at that what a fish do they kick off or should I like hold it if you let him go he should just go down the hole beautiful. yes Awesome. Thank P you, Andrew. PB's today. Let's go. Yeah. Second one this third second one this week. Yeah. Blue gill. Big one. That's a giant. That's a giant, dude. That's the biggest one. That is a giant. Dude, that's a giant. That was the biggest blob in humanity is blobs. So big. <laughs> Look at the smile on your face, bud. <laughs> what do we got? Oh, oh no! No! Oh, <laughs> The ball was so big. That was the biggest one by far. Ooh, that hurt. That was so big. That was so big. That was so big. This is not a good bad fish, dude. It's a large one. There we go. A little out of season largey, but. Not too bad. Oh. <laughs> nice little fish. First large of the day, going back. See you later. Right away, just moved. Big blobs. That wasn't even the biggest blob on there. Big fish. Big fish. Nice. Choke that. It's a nice three. Beautiful colors. What nice colors, huh? Guys, look at that largey. That scared everything. Scared everything. Came right in, just choked it. Red, red lips. She got some lipstick on. We're gonna get her back. It's not target species, but definitely welcomed. See you later, girl. Bye bye. Graceful. Woo, we can go home. Big it. Largey. Out of season. It's like friggin' largey fest right now. The screen is loaded, guys. Bluegills, crappies. That's my third largey. Just had like a three pounder. Darren had a three pounder. See ya, bud. Tantrum. Mini, mini tantrum right now. Just killing them. Man, that little guy right there, that guy, is catching a lot of these guys today. Get him back. 
see you, buddy. Oh, we came back up. Hey, how's it going? Go back down. There you go. Another one bite the dust. That is not what we want. That's not what we want. We need a big crappy. That's not what we want. That's not what we want. Need a big crappy. Big in. <laughs> hey? I caught like eight when you're gone. This is a big one. Energy? Yeah. So I didn't catch a single fish. <laughs> like because there's just less and less fish. It's literally here. Uh, yeah. Like I was marking a couple, but I didn't even get a bite. Wow. Literally, you picked up your sonar to start walking back, and in the time you made it from me to here, from there to here, I had three. In that time you walked. <laughs> that was Let's go. I'm going to end it on that note. Yeah, sure. Wow, that turned out to be a good day. Well, guys, that is a wrap. We just got off the ice. We're headed back to the truck. We had a pretty slow morning, but uh, overall a very, very good day. Uh, we are headed to the house now. We are going to use some of the catch and cook, and we are going to cook up our bluegills that we kept. Kept a few smaller crappie and that big white perch. I was saying earlier it was a white bass, but it's actually a white perch. I knew that. I just confuse the two very often. But uh, yeah, we're headed off the ice right now. We're gonna make the drive home, uh, clean up those fish. That small, small tantrum that we're using. I was using like uh, blue and silver, like very natural color. Killed it, bunch of bluegills. Me and Darian both had some crappies. So all in all, great day. Had that monster carp that Darian had. The giant crappie that he had. Can't think of a better way to spend a Friday. Like I said, we're gonna go home right now, cook up that fish and uh, Hopefully do a nice little catch and cook for you guys to see with some crunchy catch and cook, maybe a little bit of Cajun. So let's get to the house, clean up those fish, and uh, see what it's going to taste like. Haven't even tried it yet. should be amazing. We just got home, we did all the catch and cook. We used the crunchy. We got all that white perch, crappy, some bluegills done up. Me and Darian are about to manja manja. Begin. So hungry. Pickled garlic. Naya. Naya wada. I'm gonna have a Pepsi and uh, that's about it. So thanks for checking out this week's video. Don't forget to go down, subscribe. Like I said, ice fishing season's coming to an end, but we got a little bit left in us and uh, I think some special things to come, so we're gonna eat our crappies and uh, see you guys next week.